getting the secure boot needs to be enabled error while trying to play Faceite. This issue stops you from launching the game, but don't worry, I'll show you exactly how to fix it step by step. Step 1. Check if secure boot is enabled. Press Windows plus R, type msinfo32, and hit enter. In the system information window, look for secure boot state. If it says disabled, follow the next steps to enable it. Step 2. Enable secure boot from BIOS, restart your PC, and press the BIOS key, usually F2, F12, DEL, or ESC depends on your motherboard brand. Once in BIOS, go to the boot or security tab. Find secure boot and set it to enabled. Save changes and exit BIOS usually by pressing F10 and selecting yes. Your PC will restart try launching FaceSight again. Step 3. Switch boot mode to UEFI. If secure boot is grayed out in BIOS, your system might be in legacy mode. In BIOS, find boot mode or UEFI, legacy boot. Change it from legacy to UEFI. Save and exit BIOS, then try launching FaceSight again. Step 4. Update your BIOS if needed. Press Windows plus R, type msinfo32, and check your BIOS version. Visit your motherboard manufacturer's website and download the latest BIOS update. Follow their instructions to update your BIOS. After updating, enable Secure Boot again and try launching FaceSight. Step 5. Reinstall FaceSight and Tai Cheat. Press Windows plus R, type appos.cpl, and hit enter. Find FaceSight and Tai Cheat, right click, and select uninstall. Restart your PC, download, and install the latest version from the official FaceSight website. Step 6 Run FaceSight as administrator. Right click the FaceSight client shortcut. Select Run as administrator. Try launching your game again. After following these steps, your face site should be working without the secure boot error. If the issue persists, check your motherboard support page or contact face site support for further help.